broke ass EDC. Home of the working stiffs, everyday carry. Boy, a lot of these videos starting out with that. Uh, kind of moving through these Civivis. Now, uh, I'm new to this game with a lot of these things, but uh, I'll tell you what, I heard a lot about the Elementium. So I had to I had to snatch one up, and of course in blue. D2 steel, G10 handles, the $50 perfection piece. Line lock, sweet finish. It's got that, that kind of standard shape. You've got the uh, lanyard hole and the deep carry pocket clip with a with a little bit of an angle at it. It is dressed down utilitarian basic pocket knife. But honestly, I I'm getting to where I got a couple buddies coming out of the woodwork asking this question, that question. And this I've done showed it to two or three people that are not knife people and they want one. They want to step up from the garbage, garbage they're carrying. And this one has really got them going. Uh, I think this is probably one of the best introductory knives I could think of. For somebody that's not wanting to be a knife guy, they're, they're just not into it that deep, but they want a good, solid unit, you're not going to find... A better deal than that 50 bucks I mean thing is razor sharp right out right out of the box good slicey blade that D2 steel is gonna gonna last them but wait there's more so when I was ordering that one I just couldn't leave it at that because right below it when I was doing my searches was the Elementum 2 and I was like oh well if you got one you're going to need the other man this steps up for 15 more dollars you get into the 60s so if you find the right spot with the right promo code Bam, you're at this price. What does $15 add? Adds that Nitro V. The slick Natty G10 handles. And does away with that line lock and gives you a button. Now, uh, the same old boys I was goofing with, and they were, they were checking this one out and thrilled with it. Then I throwed that one out on them. And I tell you, that upsell was not hard at all. They're wanting that button lock. And that, man, that Nitro V, I'm uh, just pretty fond of it. I mean, it's pretty sharp out of the box. I've got it on that baby banter and some others. It's just like butter. Honestly, they're probably, uh, if you want a showpiece, you go with the Civivi Damascus. But if you want something that's really going to work for you, that Nitro V, that's the ticket. And then them Natty G scales, this one will hang around for a minute. You can see the reduction in them. I mean, both of these knives were spot on. They're under that uh, $70 mark. The button lock adds a little bit of girth to it but not much but I mean both of them are, are great looking knives I would definitely have to step up to the button lock centering was dead on which is kind of the Civivi has a has a solid quality Look, there you go feeling for it 
and no no lock stick, no hang up. I mean, it's. I know there's a lot of folks out uh, of the button lock, this and that. You love it, you hate it. I'm, I like it pretty good as long as you're not hanging them. You know, when you push it, it's dropping like you want. So. Can't really complain on them, man, for the, the kind of price that they're turning out. I mean, if, and if you can find the right promo code, then uh, you can get the CVV here. I guess give me a real quick one because I wasn't a, that prepared and I'm not adding it. I'm not editing this out. something new come along and if my internet moves fast enough it'll give yep it'll give my first chance to throw this out there so if you go to white mountain knives they're 65 and you can throw in broke because that's what we all are at one time or another and you can get a little bit knocked off and get this in the basket and they're free shipping on all US orders so I'll include the link and the code but if you're interested or even was on the line about either one of these don't think about it no more. I'm telling you, it's something you definitely want to add to your collection. And if you're just looking and you're getting into it, these are definitely great starter knives that you'll enjoy the quality of, even if you're not not a knife guy. So uh, don't forget, like, subscribe. Hell, leave a comment. Stay sharp, stay safe. <clears throat>